Hi, everybody. Welcome to Taste Test Tuesday. Like I say in all my Taste Test Tuesdays, just because I don't like something doesn't mean that you won't. And you may like something that I don't. Everybody's taste buds are different. Everybody's scents are different. Now, if you're new to my channel, think about subscribing. And uh, Taste Test Tuesday is when I try things that I've never tried before. And you get my first take on it. And like I say, I may not like it, but you might. But uh, anyway, here's where we're going to begin. I'm going to show you what we're going to be drinking. We're going to drink this. This is an antioxidant. Uh, it says no artificial sweetness or flavors. It's the Bolt 24 Hydration with Electrolytes. You get this at the Dollar Tree. They had it in a couple of different flavors. I believe the other one's a berry. This is in the watermelon and strawberry 16.9 ounces and you do get this from the Dollar Tree and uh, I'll show you right here if you want to like screenshot it or whatever that's all your nutrition facts there so we're going to give this a try okay never tried this before oh I smell watermelon no First I got the watermelon, then I smell strawberry. So, mm. first thing I taste is strawberry. Yeah, I think strawberry is the predominant flavor in this. Let's see. Oh, but it's good. Oh, it is good. It's got 100% daily uh, value of vitamins A and C right there. And it does, it, like I said, it has potassium, B vitamins, all that in here. Vitamin A. So hopefully you can like see all that in there. But like I said, these got these, uh, they got these. Uh, <laughs> They have this at the Dollar Tree. So this is where I got this. And they also had like a berry flavor. But this one is really, really good. If you tried this, let me know what you think. You know, in the comments below. Okay, what are we going to try next? Let's try... Well, I just did that. Let's try this. I got this at Burlington. But I imagine you can get these almost anywhere, I'm going to say. Uh, I'm not sure. There they here is Stubbs Sweet Heat Barbecue Flavored Cheese Curls. And I did pay $2.49 for these. And this is a six ounce bag. So we're going to try this. It said starts out sweet, ends up with Texas style heat. Okay, let me show you all the nutrition facts there. There you go. If you want to uh, try it, 10 grams of fat and 15 of these curls. So you have these 15. All right, let's see. Ooh, they look hot. I can smell barbecue right away. That's what they look like on the inside. So, starts out sweet, ends up with Texas style heat. Uh, okay, let's see. That's what they look like right there. Let's try it. Mm. Wow. They're right. It does start out sweet, but the flavor is so good. Oh, it's got a good, really good barbecue flavor. If you like cheese girls, you'll like these. Yeah. And like it says, it's like a sweet heat. It does get you at the back of the throat. Yep. But wow. Mmm. I think if you like cheese girls and you like stuff a little bit spicy, that you might like these. Mmm. Really good. Mm. Worth two forty nine. Mm. 
that's what it says there. It says, um, it's got sweet flavor of molasses, brown sugar, and a touch of heat. But the heat's not bad. It does have a little bite to it, but the flavor is so, so good. I like those. Those are good. Okay, we're doing good so far. I also have water for just in case I didn't like this, but I do like this. Mmm, that is very tasty. Yeah, that's good. All right, next thing that we're going to try are these. Now, I got these from the Dollar Tree. It's a two-ounce bag. It's ice cream inspired, limited summertime edition of Hershey Kisses. This is in the strawberry ice cream cone flavor. So let's try this. And the wrap is cute right there. It's got like little ice cream cones on it. I'll show you when I open it up. And that's what it looks like. It does have some little red spots in it. Mmm. Oh, that was a surprise. These are a surprise, guys. I didn't read it. It says strawberry flavored cream and cookies. Yes. These are good. When you bite into them, you get the crunch of the cookie. And I guess it's like to um, imitate the ice cream cone. But oh, these are good. Mm. If these were cold, Yes, put these in the refrigerator, eat them cold, and I bet it would be like eating a scoop of ice cream. These are good. I like those. Wow, we are doing so good here, guys. And like I said, these are at the Dollar Tree. Oh, wow. If you like strawberry, you like those. And you get that surprise crunch when you bite into it. I wasn't expecting that. I wasn't expecting the crunch at all. Okay. Let's try these. These are colors from Real Fruits and Vegetables. These are the Albanese World's Best Ultimate Eight Flavor Gummy Bears. And these were $4.99 because this is the big bag. They did have smaller bags. But my daughter says they're really, really good. So she got, she said, why, um, why get the small bag when you can get the big one? So I says, oh, I hope you're right. I hope you're right on this. But the flavors in here is like Alfonso Mango, Amity Raspberry, Asian Pear, Black Currant, Blood Orange, Crimson Cranberry, Fuji Apple, and Queen Pineapple. Has anyone ever had an Asian Pear? If you did, let me know. They are so, so good. My uh, husband introduced me to Asian Pears. And... They used to cost a dollar for one in the grocery stores. This is going back. But anyway, let's try this one. Oh, I hope it has the texture that I want. Because I am really liking the Soda Poppers by Trolley. And I can't get them. I can't find them in the Dollar Tree. Nope. All right. Hmm. This one here, hmm, I'm not sure. I don't know. This one got a weird taste to it. I don't know if that's the apple. I'm going to say apple. I don't know. I could be wrong. Or the Asian pear. I don't know what one I just ate. <laughs> I really don't. Let's try another one. 
Let's try this one and see if I can figure this one out. The little, these are cute though. They're very, um, look. The texture's good. Not like my soda pop is though. Close. All right, this is. I don't know. Hold on. All right, this is the cranberry. Yes, it's got that um bitter. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that one was the cranberry. Mmm. I like these. These are really, really good. And it says, best just got even bigger. So... There's all the nutrition facts there. And, oh, these, these are good. These are really good. The cranberry has the bitter. I think the first one that I tried might have been the Asian pear. I don't know. I'm not even sure on that. But these are good. I like the texture. They're not too soft because I don't like them when they're Mushy, that's why I like the soda pop is because they got a little bite to them. This does have a little bite, but not like the soda pop is. The soda pop is just so different. And the soda pop is still my favorite. Yeah. So anyway, these, like I said, $4.99, but they have smaller bags. And I did get this at Burlington. Oh, did I show you the nutrition information on the um, Hershey Kisses, the strawberry ice cream cone? There it is there. Those are so good. So good. I'm going to put them in the refrigerator and see. Yeah. Or even the freezer for that matter. All right. Let's try these. These are Nature's Garden Raspberry Yogurt Covered Pretzels. No high fructose corn syrup. No trans fat. No hydrogenated oils. This is seven ounces. Now, Nature's Garden is everywhere. Right? If you hear that beeping, that's Agent, my African Grey Parrot. He said he was going to be good today, but... All right, so there you go. And these were $2.99 right there. So let's try these. And these are made in the USA too. So I'm sure these are elsewhere. You know, products of USA. Yeah. So they must be somewhere else, right? Let me know if you've seen these anywhere. You know, outside of Burlington. Oh, I don't want that one. Here we go. I had to pick a pretty one for you. I can smell raspberry, but very lightly, like an imitation raspberry. You know, the pretzel. Your nutrition facts right there. Hmm. Hmm. They give you a lot. And it has a zip tie. But I'm going to tell you. Very little raspberry flavor in this. Very little. I taste the saltiness of the pretzel and the pretzel the most. Yeah, very little raspberry flavor, but it is there. There's a little sweetness. So anyway, yeah. Ah, not my favorite, but like I said, if you like pretzels, you get more of a pretzel flavor out of them. All right, have some water. Now, we're going to try these. I got these from Aldi's, guys. These are the kettle, <laughs> kettle chips, because you know what I did last time. I'm like, they taste like kettle. It doesn't say kettle. Can they get it any bigger, guys? 
Oh my gosh. And then everybody was commenting, Donna, it says kettle in big letters. I went, looked at the bag. I go, oh my gosh, it's right there. So these are the Cuban sandwich flavored kettle chips. And these came from Aldi's. And I think they were like two and change, if I can remember correctly. But their stuff in Aldi's is very reasonable anyway. So that's what they look like. Let's give it a try. Agent, stop the squeaking. Right there. It says delicioso. Mmm. Your nutrition information. I don't know if I showed you that. I can taste pickle. Oh my gosh. I taste pickle. What are they supposed to taste like? It says, I don't know. But I do taste pickle. What's in a, um, what is, what's in a Cuban sandwich? I can see pickle there. Looks like pickle, chicken, some other kind of meat. Mmm, these are good. I do taste strong pickle flavor. Gluten free. Mm. These are good. Nine grams of fat and 12. I like these. Yes. They do taste like bread, kind of, and pickle. Yeah, these are good. All right, so these came from Aldi's. Now I'm gonna try one more thing and then we'll do a little recap. And we're gonna try these. Tic Tacs, Coca-Cola. And it says, made with Coca-Cola. Limited edition. So let's see if they taste like Coca-Cola. My favorite soda. I love Coca-Cola. Should I try? I'm going to try one to start. Let me show you. It does say Coca-Cola on the little thingy there. Hmm. Let me bite it. Not really. Oh, wait a minute. A little bit. Yes. When you bite it. When you bite it, you can get the essence of the Coca-Cola. Yes. Not bad. Not bad. Yeah. They could have made it a little bit stronger of Coke. That wouldn't have hurt me at all. But anyway, let's recap. These are good. I like them. But like I said, they could have gave it more Coca-Cola flavor. This is good. And these were from the Dollar Tree. They're at the checkout. This is good. This came from the Dollar Tree. The watermelon strawberry. Yeah. Mmm. I like that. It's very refreshing. I like that a lot. Okay. Let's see. These are good. The Yes uh, Stubbs Sweet Heat Barbecue Cheese Curls. Those are good. I like them. They got a little bit of heat, get you at the back of the throat, but nothing there you can't handle. You know, if you like a little heat, that is. If you're not used to heat, I don't know. It might, you know, bother you. Everybody's different, though. That's what I say. Everybody's different. Okay. These are good, but they're not my... Um, Soda pop is. 
I don't know, guys. I don't know what it is with the Charlie Soda Poppers, but those are my favorite. Yes, but these are good. These are good, and you get all the different flavors, so you can't get bored with them, right? Okay. These here that I got from Burlington, you get a big pretzel flavor, very little raspberry on that. Not much raspberry at all. There is a little sweetness to it, but yeah, not my favorite. And these, I like these. I wanna, I'm gonna throw these in the freezer right now. I wanna get them like frozen and see if it's gonna taste like strawberry ice cream. I got a big surprise when I bit, in, bit into it and I got that cone feeling, you know? So I like those, I like those a lot. And then the last thing with the Cuban sandwich flavored, I taste a lot of pickle in here and like bread or something. Yeah, these are really good. And they're, they're brand guys, it's all these brand Clancy's and they're really, really good. Yes, so that's it for my taste test Tuesday for today. Yes, let me know in the comments below if you tried any of this. And if you did, did you like it or, you know, and have you seen these anywhere, you know, like in regular stores or whatever? Let me know that. Okay, guys, everybody stay safe out there. Thank you for watching. And until next time, bye now.